Hi, my name is Paul Henderson. I'm going in for rhinoplasty tomorrow at about 6.30 a.m. I'm going to be making a video, like a minute every day. It's going to show the progression of what the rhinoplasty starts out as and all the stages that it goes through. Um, as you can tell, my nose is a little off to, I think it's off to the left. Could be off to the right, I can't remember. Um, I'll turn sideways, you can see the side profile. I have a small bump, but it's really small. All right. I think that showed up. So like I said, I'm going to do a minute every day. Um, this will be my first video ever doing, so hopefully it turns out good. Um, that's it. Okay, so um, tomorrow's a big day. It's going to be at 6.30 in the morning. I'm getting like a little, a little nervous about the whole thing, but um, <sighs> okay, it's uh, six o'clock. No, five o'clock. It's a uh, Tuesday morning, uh, day of surgery. About another hour and a half to go. Getting a little nervous. See, shaking. Um, just gonna be walking around the lobby a little bit upstairs just to calm my nerves, and then as soon as my friend is ready. We're going to go downstairs. She's going to eat and I'm just going to watch because I can't have nothing. Yeah, getting a little nervous. I just hope it all goes as uh, smooth as it should. All right, and then maybe in about three hours you'll uh, see what the bandages look like. All right, see ya. All right, just got back from surgery. As you can see, uh, I got the bandage on my nose. Uh, yeah, I got some uh, bruising, I believe, but I can't see it because the viewfinder is turned sideways, and I'm sure I'm talking kind of funny right now. Yeah, no pain. Uh, feel pretty good. Eyes are a little blurry, probably from watering. Anyway, uh, yeah, that's it. It's, uh, I don't know what time it is, my watch. I don't have my watch on. All right. Yep. <coughs> yeah, I got some blood, as you can see. Still no pain. Can't talk right because my nose is all like freaking packed up with crapola. But uh, yeah. Okay, I got all my meds separated. The time that I'm supposed to take them: 4 a.m., 10 a.m., 4 p.m., 10 p.m. Uh, so I'm just gonna. Take it easy. Okay, it's uh, see, it's five o'clock, so it's about ten hours after the surgery. Yeah, looks pretty bad. Yeah, no pain though. We'll see you tomorrow. I have to go for my follow-up. Okay, well, it's Wednesday morning. Twenty-four hours later, well, twenty-two. And as you can see, I uh, bled a little bit last night. Let's see the mirror. Yeah. Uh, still no pain. I took the Valium last night. It didn't work. I had to take a sleeping pill. But uh, this is about 22, uh, maybe 20 hours after surgery. And uh, this is how it looks. Not too bad. But I go to my uh, follow-up visit today. They're going to show me how to clean it and everything. Uh, it's good. All right. Till later. Okay, today's Wednesday morning. I just woke up. It is five o'clock. I'm gonna go downstairs in the lobby and get something to drink and maybe eat so I can take some more meds. Uh, today's the follow-up visit. It's at about 12:30. They'll take the bandage off and clean my nose and show me how to do it. Otherwise, when I woke up today, uh, I was under no pain. You know, I did take the meds like I was supposed to uh, all day long yesterday. I uh, took the sleep aid, which is the value, that did nothing for me. So I ended up taking a sleeping pill, that knocked me out about an hour later. Um, yeah, so there's no pain, no nothing, kind of disappointed. Looks like some of the bruising went down, so that, that kind of sucks too. But uh, yeah, not too bad. And if you ever get a chance, you should uh, YouTube a rhinoplasty video. But if you're going to have it done, I wouldn't wa watch it if I were you, because some people uh, Probably will change their mind afterwards. Well, that's it for right now. I'm gonna go get something to eat.
Talk to you later. Clock, it's Wednesday. I got three more hours to my pre-op, or my post-op. But, uh, it's been about, uh, 25 hours after the surgery, and now it's starting to get, like, uh, pretty puffy. Uh, yeah. Looks pretty bad, huh? Yeah, way to go. Anyway, that's it. So I guess it's got to get worse before it gets better. Okay, but I do have to say there is zero pain. I'm not feeling nothing. Just, uh, it's hard to swallow. Well, because you know, I can't breathe, so that sucks. But yeah, no pain. Guess the doctor did a good job. Good morning. It's Thursday morning. It is approximately 48 hours after my surgery. I had my uh, post off yesterday in uh, Beverly Hills. Um, everything went good. They took the packing out, didn't hurt at all. They checked out my nose best they could, and, uh, and the tip is totally perfect. It's not dying, so that's a good thing. I haven't seen myself in the mirror yet. This is, uh, I just woke up like uh, 20 minutes ago and just put a shirt on. Uh, I know it's a little swollen, I can feel it, but uh, I have zero pain whatsoever. I did take my meds last night. Um, I took the, the Valium. I don't even know if that even works, but I kind of like ended up falling asleep pretty good, so I guess it must have kicked in. I go back on Monday for the removal of a cast patient, but so far everything's good. I don't see any problems. I have no pain. Um, uh, let's see what they do. Oh, yesterday they, um, you know, of course they took the packing out. They showed me how to clean it each day. I had to do it uh, two times a day with peroxide Q-tips and uh, put some ointment on the that uh that thing they cut to pull the nose all the way back and they stitch it up and everything so anyway yeah all is good no pain just uh all i can do is wait till monday and just uh hang in there all right i guess uh that's it until tomorrow i can't remember if i mentioned uh what i had done they straight they broke the nose to straighten it because it was a little uh, off crooked so they straightened it, they used a donor rib cartilage to build the nose back up and to make it wider. They also shaved down the hump that I had, I had a real small hump. Um, so yeah, so, so I have a donor cartilage in my nose, that's pretty cool. And apparently it must have took because it still, I mean it feels perfect, I mean I think if something was going to go wrong it would have went wrong by now. And it didn't. So. Keep my fingers crossed, everything goes fine. And like I said on Monday, I go back for the cast removal. So it's a little after two days. You know, I know I did a little bit of filming this morning, but I just gotta say, you know, I decided I was gonna like, um, skip my med, meds. I mean, I was gonna take all the other ones, but I was just gonna skip the Norco. Um, so I didn't take it and about two hours later, yeah, I don't feel too good. I got like a little bit of pain. I mean, not bad, but I did take the Norco and I think it's finally catching back up. But it could also be that I just did like a little too much, a little too much today. I just went out and walked around, went to breakfast, went to Sam's Club, did some more walking and I don't know. I think I did too much out in the sun and I think my tip might got a little sunburnt. But, uh, oh yeah. Then I went to Tilted Kilt, had a beer. Maybe that's what did it. Yeah, that wasn't that wasn't smart. Well, anyway, yeah, I just wanted to give a little heads up. I do have a little bit of pain, so it's not like pain free, but pretty darn close. But how do I look? I look like crap? Because um, kind of feel a little bit like crap. I don't know. Yeah. See ya. Let's see, it's, uh, it's Friday morning, it's 4.03, wow, uh, man, I can barely, uh, barely stand up, I think I must have took that, uh, that, um, that volume a little bit uh, too late last night, I fell asleep about 9 o'clock and then I, I woke up and I figured, oh shit, I better, uh, better take it so it must still be in my system, but, um, Anyway, there's like a, 
no pain. I feel pretty good today. I'm going to go look in the mirror and see what it looks like. All right. Let's see. Wow. Doesn't look too bad. Um, yeah. At least, my, uh, at least my beard's coming back. Yeah, I don't want to trip. I could probably, uh, probably take this thing off. Let's see. Hey, no blood. Good thing. Yeah, so like I said, it's been uh, it's been three days, close to uh, 72 hours. It's coming along pretty good. I've been cleaning it uh, a couple times every day. Uh, I think, yeah, yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah. So three times. No. Yeah, when did I start cleaning? I don't know. I can't keep track of these days. But anyway, it's been uh, it's been three days. I know I cleaned it at least four times, <clears throat> and it's a uh, it's Friday. So probably a few more days, a few more days of filming, and then uh, Monday I go back and they uh, they um, I don't know what they're gonna do. Shit, I can't even think straight right now. Oh, Monday they're gonna take the cast off. A result? <laughs> Man, yeah, I guess that uh, I guess that volume is still in, still in my system. Yeah, but anyway, yeah. So okay, uh, let me start over. So it's been three days. Uh, it's Friday. No pain. I feel pretty good. Uh, so that means I got Saturday, Sunday. So <clears throat> over two more days. And then I'll be going back to uh, <clears throat> to the doctors, and they'll um, and they'll take the the cast off. No man, man, I'm thirsty. All right, till tomorrow. <laughs> All right. Yeah, the one thing uh, that would be nice to do would be to uh, be to. Uh, ah, damn it. To uh, take a shower, because um, uh, it's been a. Uh, I think Tuesday was the last day I took one. Oh man, that tastes really good again. Yeah, Tuesday was the, the last day I took a shower, so I just well, till tomorrow, I'll do some more filming. Nah, and then uh, I'll probably take the this whole little contraption with me when I uh, go down do uh, profiles of Beverly Hills to. Uh, Get the cast off, and then uh, you guys will see it first. All right. <laughs> All right. Hey, if you noticed, I put a shirt on, and yeah, it's the same blue shirt that I've been wearing for the past uh, three, four days, something like that. I like blue. So anyway, it's uh, like I said, it's Friday. I think I'm gonna try to take a shower today. The only thing I can't do is I can't get the Cast West. Let me get another drink of water. Oh shit. Here, hang on a second. See, I'm still having a hard time standing up. And I must have a. But I feel pretty good. So, anyway, I'm gonna go take a shower and I'll probably feel a little better. And then, like I said, on Monday, that's the big day. So, I'm looking forward to it. Alright. <laughs> Alright. Uh, yeah, it's about uh, 6.50. I just wanted to do a little update. It's um, just getting ready to go to breakfast. I feel like getting out of the house for a while. Cleaned my nose a little bit. Uh, did a little whore bath. Wiped down my face and cleaned up and changed my shirt. No more blue shirt. Other than that, it's doing pretty good. Uh, like I said, there's no pain, no nothing. Swelling's going down, but it's going to take a good, uh, probably, uh, um, I don't know, six months for everything to settle down. Maybe a little bit more. It's hard to really say, but we'll. Uh, it'll take some time. All right. Catch you later. 
Good morning. It is Saturday. It's 4 a.m. It's been a uh, it's been almost four days since the surgery. Um, everything's going good, as you can tell. Look a hell of a lot better today than I did uh, the following day after. Now let me get something to drink. I'm pretty uh, pretty parched. Hang on a second. Ah, oh, shit. That's some good stuff. I also made some coffee. Anyway, let's go outside real quick. Now, nah, watch the step. Okay, so like I said, it's Saturday, it's 4 a.m. It's been close to four days. I still have uh, all day today, Sunday, and then Monday at 3, I go back to uh, Profiles of Beverly Hills to have the stitches take out and uh, get the cast off. It's going to look sweet. Um, yeah, I'm getting real excited. You can kind of see that it's already, uh, it's definitely straighter than it was. And I'm sure it's uh, swollen, but it feels fine. Uh, just uh, got like a little red still inside my eye. No big deal. Uh, and uh, nothing hurts. Everything's good. Oh, one more thing. Um, oh, shoot. Yeah, a second. You know, there's a lot of people that didn't know that I was going to have this done, but there's a few that did. So I had this whole little charade going on where I went to Mexico, got in a Jeep accident. And it was just supposed to be like a couple little lines on Facebook, but it uh, kind of like, kind of like uh, snowballed into something, uh, something really big. So I guess on uh, Monday or Tuesday, I'm going to have to fess up. I have some posts that are on Facebook that are on hold. That's the real story of, you know, going to the doctors, uh, you know, the, the real hotel I was at in Beverly Hills. So then uh, once this is all over and it's all done, I'll uh, have to like just post a big sorry to everybody. But like I said, you know, some people knew and they were playing along, but I just didn't need a bunch of people to say, oh, why are you doing it? You know, shit, you know, your nose wasn't that bad. Well, you know, I wanted to have it done. I always hated my nose. I just never liked it, so I just figured, hey, what the hell? It's my nose, my body. I can do whatever I want with it, and it's gonna look good. So, uh, uh, all right. See you guys tomorrow. Let me get up. Get some water. Oh man. Oh shit. Not good. Um, last night I was having a hard time going to sleep, so I thought I'd uh, take a two volumes. Nah, maybe that might have been a mistake, cause uh, it kicked my ass. Let's see. Uh, what shirt should I wear today? Um, eh. I like the blue ones. Let's see, how do I look? Yeah. Not too bad. I could stay in the shower though. Um, yeah, so anyway, it's uh, Sunday. And it is. Oh God, I can't even do the math. Can't even do the math. Um, 24, 46, 24, 46, no. 24, 46, 48, 96, 72, no, 96. I gotta get the calculator out. It's too early in the morning to figure out how many hour, uh, how many uh, hours it's been. But I had it done pretty much Tuesday at seven. And today is Sunday, and it's 4 a.m. So, do the math. Alright. I might keep most of this morning video, I don't know. It probably looks pretty crappy, so I might just, uh, only keep a portion of it. But, yeah. Wow. Yeah, what a, what a difference, uh, 
What a difference five days make. Oh shit. Okay, I'm gonna make a. I took. I made a little slideshow on Facebook yesterday. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna probably just videotape the Facebook slideshow from the camera from the from the iPad. But for right now, I gotta I gotta get some coffee. Yeah, a little coffee center in my room. Not too bad. So anyway, I'm gonna go. Uh, I'm gonna go videotape that and see how it looks. If not, then I'll just uh, download it from the um, computer to. Uh, the final YouTube video, which will air on YouTube. So, it's been five days. Doesn't look too bad. This morning was kind of hard to wake up because I took two volumes and kicked my ass. But, uh, yeah. Yeah, so all is good. I'm just uh, having my morning Joe. I just, uh, I want to show you again. See, little uh, little coffee center. Oh, here's something you got to see. I was on Playgirl a long time ago. Yeah, yeah, that's me. A little jealous. Yeah, I just um, got done weighing myself. One hundred and fifty-three point four. I think uh, last Monday I weighed a. Uh, about 156 point something. I guess uh, lose a few pounds when you eat good for a little while. About a year ago, I had my body fat tested. It was 17.1%. Uh, Say I'm about five, eight and a half. Anyway, all's good. But I'm sure I lost a couple pounds pooping. Um, and uh, let's see, that's it. And tomorrow's the big day, 3 p.m. I'll take. Good morning. Today's day six. Today's the big day. I get to go back to Beverly Hills Profiles. I'm sorry, Profiles of Beverly Hills. Get the cast off. It's going to look sweet. I'm going to go take a look in the mirror right now to see what it looks like. Let's see. Uh, that's the first time I looked at it this morning. Yeah, not too bad. Just got a little bruise in here. Still got some stuff in my eye. A little gunk in my nose, but hey, what the heck. Yeah, it's going gonna, it's gonna to look sweet. Ah, oh, shit. Where's my, uh, where's my, where's my coffee? Oh. Gotta have some coffee. Oh, man, that tastes good. Had kind of a, had kind of a rough day yesterday. I don't know why. I didn't take any value. All I took was the antibiotics. I mean, um, that, uh, anti-inflammatory. Yesterday I ended up sleeping like uh, three quarters of the whole day. I have no idea why, because all the other days I never did it. And uh, but yesterday I just slept the whole day. Um, I had a headache this morning, probably from not drinking enough water. Since you know, the fact was that I was asleep, so I couldn't drink. But uh, other than that, a uh, scale from one to ten, the pain level was probably one half to one, and one was the probably only because of yesterday when I woke up I fell asleep on the futon and then I um, I don't know what I, what happened but I went to go rub my nose and I just like tapped it and it's like fuck that freaking hurt I mean I didn't hit it hard just tapped it and that was it but other than that uh, you know from day one never had no pain just a bunch of swelling went through a bunch of different stages and it sure was a lot different you know from day to day I mean it got real bad and then I just started clearing up and going away and uh, I think it was the best choice I ever made. I'm going to be totally happy with the results, but it's going to take probably six months for it to, you know, everything to settle down. It's going to go through all these different stages. I'm sure when they take it off, it's going to be a little, little tweak still because there's a lot of crap still up inside my nose, you know, scabs and blood, dried, dried whatever's up in there. I don't know. The packing's not anymore. They, they took that out the other day, uh, the following day. So yeah, so uh, it's all good. Everything looks like it's healing good. Nothing turned black. That's a good sign. Uh, yeah, so I'm just uh, just have my morning Joe at five in the morning, um, and then uh, uh, I guess guess that's gonna be it. Let's see if there's anything else. Let me take one more look. 
Yeah. Oh. Might have to color this. Yeah. Guess I'm just for men. Uh, I hate the gray man. It sucks. Okay, it's uh, still Monday. It is 8.30. I just got out of the shower. It's been pretty much uh, six days since I've taken a shower. Uh, I took a little wipe down here and there. But today I had to take a full one because, like I said, I'm going. And then I decided to uh, do some just for men. Make me feel a little younger. Yeah, so how's it look? Do I? Yeah. Let me see. Yeah, not too bad. I should be on their cover. Eh, whatever. <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah, it's been six days. I soaked, uh, I soaked up as much of the... Oh, why did I do that? I, uh, I, ran an, I ran quite a bit of water on it to soften it up because that's what I was told to do. Because that should help with the removal. And where's my coffee? Yeah, got to have my morning coffee. Ah, oh, man, that's good. Yeah, so, um, that's about it. Uh, just gotta wait till I go, and then, uh, yeah. <laughs> Alright, here I am at, uh, Profiles of Beverly Hills. My appointment's in about 15 minutes, then I head upstairs. They'll take the stitches out, take the cast off and do whatever they have, whatever else they have to do, I don't know. But, uh, yeah, looking forward to it. It's gonna be cool. Should look pretty good when I'm done. Hopefully no one will recognize me. All right, just got the cast off. The tape you see is, I don't know what the tape's for, but it's for something. I gotta keep it on for a couple weeks. So it looks pretty good. A little swollen on one side, but it'll go down. Um, it was a painless cleaning. I cleaned all the crap out of my nose, took the stitches out underneath here, and uh, let's see what else. Oh, when they took the cast off, it was it was fine, didn't hurt. Just a little swollen on, I think, this side, and then you know, all down the whole bridge, it's uh, a little puffy, but it's getting pretty good. All right, gotta go upstairs now. Good morning. It is 4.54, it is Tuesday. It's almost, uh, it's about three hours shy. Um, from having the surgery done on Tuesday, that probably ha that probably started at about seven o'clock. So about an hour and a half. Uh, yesterday was uh, Monday. I had my appointment at three p.m. to have the cast taken off and nose cleaned out and the stitches like right here taken off. Eh, no pain. Only one stitch kind of felt like a little pinch, but not bad at all. Um, so all I can say is from day one until now I virtually had zero pain on a scale from one to ten I'd have to say it was probably half uh, and then yesterday when I was taking a shower after what six days I was washing my face in the shower and kinda like forgot and I went whoop right across the tip so that counts as a number one and that only hurt for about three minutes and then it kinda went away why don't we go take a look in the mirror um, I got no pants on. I didn't feel like putting them on, so hey, what the heck. So let's, uh, let me go check it out. All right. Oh, God. Whew. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. He, he just did really good. Ah, fuck. Uh, he wouldn't get like that. Damn. Man. Okay, hang on a second. Whew. <laughs> I can't believe the difference. Man. Kind of like... <sighs> Alright. I think I got my composure back. Whew, that was the first time that I've uh, really seen it. Um, let me go on the patio. So yeah, so anyway, today's seven days. It's gonna, I got a follow-up appointment in 
three weeks. They go back and then they're going to do uh, Dr. Solomon. Uh, could see from when he was cleaning me out he said everything looks perfect he said that I heal very well and very quick and uh, yeah I mean a lot of people couldn't believe the difference from uh, one day to the next because you know I took photos every day so anyway this is the best thing I ever did I've been wanting to do it since I was like 15 years old and uh, I just wish I would have did it a lot sooner but you know what uh, everything happens for a reason so I think uh, this it was supposed to be this time when I got it done, and uh, I searched I searched on the internet, and then when I found that guy, I mean those uh, Dr. Lipman and Dr. Solomon, I you know checked out their website and everything, and everything looked on the up and up. They they were in that building for ten years, and they had hundreds of before and after photos of people. Of course, uh, no no movie stars, and I'm sure they probably wouldn't. I'm sure they have them, but they probably don't post them on their website. Uh, one thing I can say is that the elevator guy, and then there's this place called the Normandy Coffee Shop, or Normandy Cafe, that's on the men, men's, it's on the main level. It's on the main level. Um, yeah, they were telling me that, uh, the first, my consultation, when I first went there, said yeah they get people from all over the world well all over the state and country probably from other other countries I mean I don't know but anyway they get people from all over that fly in to have it done they see movie stars coming in and out of there all the time so you know what if that is true it's a damn good that's a damn good sign and from what I can see he did a superb job so that should probably be about it this will be my last uh, my last uh, video for the YouTube I just, uh, let's see if there's anything else I could say. Um, nah, there really isn't, I guess. Yeah, I'll, I'll edit all of them. It's probably going to be about 20 minutes long. Hopefully it wasn't more, because I don't want people to get too bored. But if anyone is thinking of having it done, no matter where you go, I went to Pro Profiles of Beverly Hills, so I'd recommend them. But if you find your own doctor, then fine, go there. But I'll tell you this, do not go to Mexico. Uh, I would suggest watching the series Botched, and you'll find out why you wouldn't want to go there or try to save some money and go someplace cheap. You want to, you want to, you, you know those saying, you pay for what you get? Well, you pay for what you get. If you want to pay $3,000 for a nose job, then go ahead because you're going to get a $3,000 nose job. And then you're going to end up going back and having it redone somewhere else, and they might not be able to fix it. So anyway, Profiles of Beverly Hills, you guys rock. Oh, I got a friend that said that. That's kind of funny. So, <laughs> so I, she said I got to do it after, after the end of every video. So maybe I'll do it again. <laughs> yeah, yeah, such a ham, huh? So anyway, yeah. I'll, uh, I'll see about posting some uh, information about uh, Profiles of Beverly Hills on there. So if you guys want to check it out, anyone who wants to have it done, just fly there, get it done, and you will be happy. So that's it. That's it for the video. Well, today's day eight. Almost exactly uh, eight days to the day. I feel pretty good. Yesterday, I slept probably most of the day again. I don't know why. I guess I just, everything just caught up. Uh, I got some coffee on the patio. I'm going to go get it. And once again, I got no pants on. I was going to put them on, but I figured, hey, you guys can't, you guys can't see nothing anyway. But, uh, all right. So, yeah, so today's the last day. There's no more. My tip's uh, a little swollen. It hurt yesterday. But other than that, the color looks pretty good. Everything looks like it's uh, kind of like trying to like settle down a little bit. It, uh, let me see. Uh, uh, anyway, that's it. It's been eight days. If anything was going to go wrong, I think it would have went wrong by now. The stitches down here look perfect. So there's no infection there. Um, all I had was some clear liquid come out yesterday, which was probably... Uh, uh, sinus fluid that was like up in my cavity that uh, finally was able to drain out because you know 
all the packing and all the crap that was in there is out. Plus, I've been using that uh, nasal spray every day, trying to do it uh, two to three times a day. And, uh, yeah, so I still got another week off of work. I don't go back until next Wednesday. I'm really glad I took two weeks off. So if anyone does decide to have this type of surgery done, I'd recommend taking two weeks off because there's no way that I could have went back yesterday. I mean, just going for a walk, you know, it was just, I don't know, if it was making it kind of like, it was it was hurting more. But uh, other than that, yeah, it's uh. I'm happy with the outcome. Lennerson, still doing my uh, rhinoplasty recovery video. I'm two days shy of two weeks. And I'll just mention it again that I had the surgery done at Profiles of Beverly Hills in West Hollywood, California. Dr. Jason Littner and Dr. Payman Solomon were the two surgeons that worked on me. Uh, there was, I think, probably five people in the room all together. I was already passed out before the doctors came in, but I think there was, a, there was at least three. There might have been four, but I think it was three. Um, everything went perfect. I had virtually zero pain. I'm going to look in the mirror right now. I took a shower this morning and shaved and stuff, but I did my damnedest not to look in the mirror, but I'm going to look. No, 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 no. I don't want to look yet. Because last time I looked, I cried like a little schoolgirl in the video. I'm not going to do that again. I'll do it next month when I go back on 9-6, so I have to go for a um, one-month check. Wait, there's mirrors there. Um, one-month checkup. Nothing's falling loose. You know, of course you can tell nothing died. You know, nothing fell off on like Michael Jackson's nose. But all's good. Everything healed good. I feel good. I still got uh, two more days off. Today's Sunday, so I got Monday and Tuesday off. I go back to work on Wednesday. So anyone who decides to have this done, I'd highly recommend taking off at least two weeks. If you can afford three, do it. Definitely not one. There's no way. I could have went back after one. So two's, two's best. Two weeks, two days. So anyway, like I said, I'm uh, two days shy of two weeks, and I think it healed up pretty nice. Still a little swollen on this side, so once the swelling goes down, it should start evening out a little bit more. Um, my tip feels a lot better. Still kind of tender. I think it's still a little swollen too, but, uh, but everything's going down good. I'm just drinking plenty of water and liquids and no beer and no cigars. As soon as it heals good, I'm going to start smoking again. I only do like one a week. Anyway, that's it. I just wanted to give a little update. And I'm happy with it. Oh, I just got to show you a picture that I uh, I had blown up. I don't know what I was thinking in this photo. Kind of cracks me up every time I look at it. So I got it sitting on my desk to remind me of uh, what I went through. <laughs> anyway, that's it. Signing off. Okay, so today is 9-6. I'm going in for my 30-day follow-up visit to Profiles of Beverly Hills. Um, They'll be checking probably, they'll be looking up inside, make sure everything's all still attached and coming along good, which I think it is. Um, they'll probably do a shot of cortisone and a tip because it's still kind of swollen. And I still have a little swellingness right here. Other than that, it looks pretty good, feels good. I do a neti pot every day for the past two weeks just to keep it flushed out. Um, really, that's about it. So I guess after I come back home, I'll do another video because, uh, like I said in other videos, it takes anywhere between 3, 6, to 12 months for it to finally heal. And it's going to look good. So, uh, that's probably uh, that's probably about it. Ooh, nothing else to say. So, <laughs> Okay, I just got back from my 30-day uh, follow-up visit. I go again in November, which would be, I guess, considered a 90-day follow-up visit. And then in 6 months, at the 6 month, that's when they'll take the after photos and compare them with the beginning photos. But anyway, the visit went really good today. I got a thumbs up. He cleaned the crap out of my nose and that felt pretty good. So I'm all, still got stuff in there, but he cleaned out most of it. Anyway, it's healing great. Uh, no problems. I do have uh, still some uh, pretty good swelling on this side and my tip is swollen. So because I'm swollen on this side, it's still kind of like shifting the nose a little bit. It takes a good six months to a year for the final results. But right now, I'm happy with them. Hey, it's Paul Henderson here. I don't know why I keep saying my name, but hey, what the heck. Anyways, 10 minutes before my appointment at Profiles of Beverly Hills in West Hollywood. I'm going in for my six-month follow-up with Dr. Jason Littner and Dr. Payman Solomon. And uh, let me head up there and I'll do a little video of uh, the two docs and me together. Anyway, that's it. And then I guess I probably won't be back for like another year. And then they'll, uh, they'll do one more checkup. <sighs> Getting a little nervous here. Um, anyways, that's it. Wish me luck. <laughs> Had a skiing accident. Okay, this is Paul Henderson. I'm at my six-month follow-up with uh, 
Dr. Jason Lindner, Dr. Payman Solomon. Um, just had my six month uh, follow up. Got some photos taken. And these are the two doctors that uh, did my surgery. And uh, he gave me the all clear, right? You're all good. <laughs> yeah, you're great. Yeah, so I got another six months, I come back. And then uh, this is the final installment on my uh, YouTube video that shows all the recovering that I went through. Was of fun. And I had zero pain. So I guess when you have a good surgery, then uh, everything goes nice and smooth. And uh, happy for you. Yeah, you, you guys did an awesome job. Great, great patient. Thank you. It's very emotional. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, thanks, guys. Thanks, 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 Paul. Damn, I told myself I wasn't going to cry, and I did it anyway. <laughs> <laughs> thanks great. so much. Yeah, for thanks. Well, that's it. So uh, I'm going to put it on YouTube. And thanks. Thank you guys for watching. <laughs> here, yeah, I just had my uh, six month follow up. That profile was the Beverly Hills and everything went good. <laughs> yep. So this is the final installment and then it's going to go on YouTube. Thank you.